Got it plugged into the sense wire, black and white wire on my car. The stripe on the diode is facing the alternator. So let's start it and see what it does. First time trying this, so hopefully I don't mess something up, burn something up. That would suck. unplug it and see what it does without it all right this one i got it bypassed let's see what it does now it was doing 14 2 14 3 so hopefully this time it's just like 14 0 so i know it's doing something That's a bust. Let's see if I can figure this out. All right, so I put it back to stock. I tried one diode, I tried two, and it didn't make no difference. When I switched them around, it dropped. It went down to 13.9. Whenever I had it normal where it was supposed to go up, it was at 14.2. And then without anything, it's at 14.2. I think this uh, voltage regulator might be like computer controlled. Maybe the ECU PCM is controlling the voltage because that didn't do anything. But as long as the high output alternator will put out the amps that it's supposed to, even if the voltage is at 13.914, I'm cool with that. But I've got a weird feeling that the alternator's not going to be able to put out that many amps. Not the alternator itself, but I feel like something with this voltage regulator or this system won't let it get more amps or voltage other than what the computer will give it. 
because this was supposed to be a 250 amp alternator and it didn't make any difference at all from the stock so hopefully i pray to god that this 370 amp is going to make a big difference especially for what i paid for it so all right well i guess that's the end of this video stay tuned when i get the new alternator i'll put it in and we'll see what happens peace